Welcome back to Crusader Kings 2 Game of Thrones mod. Hope everybody today is having a wonderful day because right before this episode, uh, I was letting time go by a little because we were having a big problem with uh, having our liege um, press his claim for the High Lordship of uh, the Wolfswood on the north. Now, before, uh, when we were pressing it for Deepwood Mott, it wasn't a problem, but for some reason it's saying now, even though we had, we bought the favor we had with the Tully, uh, our, our liege, it's saying that the council must agree. Now, I can understand that if he had a regency, but he has no regency. The law uh, for Kingdom of Trident is the same ones under the Iron Throne. So, it isn't anything that I could see that says we're not able to... Uh, wage war on um, other people in the, in the realm and it says uh, like the effects of medium realm authority say vassals are now obliged to end the internal wars of aggression when commanded by their liege and that's that's fine but that doesn't stop them from pressing the claim now uh, we're at low uh, realm authority so it's a very large degree of autonomy so he, he can ask us to stop but we don't have to and we won't be held accountable for it now, there's nothing else that I can see. In the beginning, I thought maybe the realm inheritance, but our, our realm is considered the Iron Throne, the Seven Kingdoms. So, it just means leaving this whole realm to go, like, somewhere over here in Essos. Um, and all, on top of all that, we have a favor with him to press, so I don't see why he's not doing it. Maybe a little bit of time goes by, or maybe uh, the Iron Throne goes into another war. Then maybe, I don't know. He has uh, been doing con uh, conquering little lordships. I think he just conquered something in the Stepstones, I thought. Uh, Skull Island, which, no, is way down here. Um, this guy is just under him now. I think it's so dumb. But anyways, uh, yeah, he's been conquering little shit. So hopefully he does that again. Maybe that will play a part and we'll be able to do it. But the greatest thing happened that I did not expect. If you look here on this event, all right, while we were going, uh, I was getting time go by. We had our Justicer, he had just got us a claim on Stonehenge, which we were trying to do, uh, I think, two episodes ago. I sent him there because uh, we had the High Lordship claim up here. There's no need to try to get these lower ones. Uh, now I do have him at Iron Wrath because if this thing doesn't end up, you know let me fire it then i'm gonna have to take the little ones you know i don't even know if that's possible because we have a claim on wolfswood he won't even let us press the claim for that for some reason i don't know why i i, I, can't, I don't understand why um we have to try to get a uh favor with this guy next because if he dies before we can use it i don't know what's, what's gonna happen uh, I think we pay, we paid back our loan last time. Yeah, so we can get 200 gold, so we're fine. I also have a, uh, a plot going. It just fired right before this came up. I was going to let it keep going, but when this popped up, I figured I'd record. Uh, this kid here is the Lord of Castle Coldstream. It goes to my second son's wife if he dies, and then their kids will inherit it. So it looks like I should be all right with this. 396 plot power. Um, if you can't get that all that much, then something's wrong with this game. Uh, we have three known plots where Umbrella Glover's still trying to kill us. And then uh, Liza of Iron Wrath is trying to kill us, who is a Glover. Actually, um, I thought she was the mom of one of them, but I guess not. I think she's like an ant or something, but whatever. So... We end up getting the claim on Stonehenge. Not only did he give us, all right, he he arrested. Uh, it's up here. He arrested Brent Harrius, Brandon Moore Bracken. He arrested him. I don't know why he arrested him, but then he he beheaded him without trial or anything. So he beheaded him, which he had the lordship of Stonehenge and the high lordship. So he gave us Stonehenge first, and then gave us the high lordship of South Snow. Now. This seems like, yeah, how that's that's real great, but I don't, I really don't want two high lordships in the same realm because all of this is gonna happen now. All them people that hate us in our realm are gonna try to start factions to make him either give up or uh, 
our Lord, our High Lordship. It's just gonna cause problems because there's not. I don't think there's anybody that has uh, two High Lordships in our realm. If I'm not mistaken. We can go ahead and check. Where it's me, uh, the Freys, the Heron Hall one, uh, Eskaroth. Uh, yeah, nobody has two High Lordships in this realm. Now it happens, but they tend to have a lot of problems because of it. Uh, the other vassals hate on you for it. Yeah, so I don't even think there's anybody probably in the north that happens a lot, like with the the uh, Manderleys and shit. But like other than that, like there's really not too many instances where people have two high lordships at once. A lot of times they will inherit them, but other than that, like it, it just causes so much problems because every little lord that hates on you and doesn't have a high lordship, or even the ones that do, are gonna be like. You need to give up one of them. You're too powerful. It starts to worry people. Uh, yeah, so uh, here we go. The Arbor has a High Lordship of the Arbor, and he has a High Lordship of Ocean Road. Now, his vassals probably are okay, but the other council people, like, he's not even on the council. So, yeah, we have the uh, three out of three domains, so we can um, hold on to Stonehenge for now. But I think what we're going to do, if we can do this uh, rather soon, where... We end up uh, being able to press this claim up here. I think I might uh, give this uh, Stonehenge one to my second son, Alan. Give it to him. But then again, I don't know. He's going to have uh, cold streams. So maybe I'll uh, save it for my other son and give him the high. We'll see how he turns out. Uh, we'll give it to him. Our other son's going to already inherit the bulk of our shit, so I'm not going to give it to him. But yeah, I, that was very unexpected. So I wanted to make sure too when um, this gift goes away that we gave him last time, uh, we end up giving him another one when it runs out just to keep him happy. I mean, 228, the end of Jan uh, February is when we're going to happen. So we're going to have to end up giving him another gift just to keep him happy. Lord Lucas Blackwood, I hereby invite you to participate. Attorney of Heron Hall with the best knights and lords of the Trident would be invited to compete. Uh, yeah, we're not going to risk that right now. Any other time we would, but right now is very, uh, we have to really be smart with what we do. Alright, success. The hunter that did what he was paid for made sure Master Jojen would never return for hunting trip. He would keep quiet about his ghastly deed to save his own skin, if nothing else. Alright, so now our son's wife should have inherited. So, yeah, she is the mistress of Coldstream. Uh, it goes back to Stark if she was to die without a kid. She needs to get pregnant. Now, he's lustful, but she's a uh, craven arbitrary. They don't really have anything to do with fertility, but we'll see um if she's 28 so she's starting to wind down she really needs to have a kid and then when they have a kid we'll have a blackwood and cold stream hopefully our bastard daughter will end up getting pregnant again and having a kid she had a stillborn so if we can get the lord paramount of the north to be our grandson it probably he probably won't become lord paramount of the north while we're alive all right um he wants us to attend now i think we'll attend Sometimes these things can be set up, so you got to be careful. Uh, he's not on the council, and it's not his tourney, and he just gave us land. I don't see uh, him having anything to do with it. But anyways, let's look at the faction. I guarantee somebody started one. Oh, increased council power in Blackwood. This guy, these two vassals are the Southstone vassals. Now, they're going to have a problem with us the whole time because of the fact it's not our primary title, so anybody under Stonehenge is going to say, I should have it. So it's minus 20 for both, and they're old. So hopefully in their heirs take over, it be a little easier. Actually, what I want to do too is move my uh, Stormsinger to one of theirs. Even though they're old, I'm not really looking to convert them. I'm looking to convert their heir. How old is this guy's heir? 31. So we'll go with Goldbrook first. Try that one out. Uh... We will go ahead. Um, this guy's getting a little old, so his chances are going down. So I'll put him in gold broke. Hey, it's not too good right now. He's getting old. We have a backup for when he dies. I think he's still alive. I don't know where he went. He must he must have left court. This guy's not bad, but he's 
getting old too. So uh, we'll go ahead and um, while we're waiting for things to pan out, we'll go ahead and ch check for a better one. My religion. I know they have to have the zealous trait, I think. So let's look real quick. Um, let's have it on pause. Trying to find zealous with decent learning. Um, there's zealous there. They don't have a good thing here. All right, he's zealous, but he's 60. He's already our storm singer. That doesn't help. Um, come on. A zealous person that's not a maester. He's 56, 48, uh, 34, but it's fucking God. He's incompetent. Like, they'll have good learning, but then be incompetent. All right, this guy is a little uh, younger. Maybe he'll do it. He's 16, but he's also a mastermind scholar. Probably not going to find anything better than him that has zealous. Like, he's 40. So, I guess we'll just invite him. We don't have to pay anything for him, just to make sure. All right, we need a new commander. Go ahead and unpause. Actually, let me wait, because I'm going to see if that thing's going to let me press it yet. Uh, we have Victor Broom. We have this Dan dude. Uh... I guess we'll go with Victor Broom. He's got good modifiers. Is there anything else we can get anything off of? Uh, we'll give this to that guy to try to bring down his negative opinion a little. Alright, let's see. Man, I'm hoping it just happens, man. I'm going to be rather mad having to pay all that money for that uh, favor. and We can't do nothing with it. It says the council must agree. I don't understand what the hell, what council needs to, to agree. Um, can I call him council report? I can request council support from him. Oh, that's my council. What am I doing? Alright, no, not him. Uh, can we buy a favor? Nope. Uh, buy a favor? Nope. I know the party hates me, so he's not going to do it. Uh, damn it, man. I didn't know if there was, like, maybe you can, uh, ask for their support. And they will, uh, I guess, tell him to do it. But see, that's the thing. The law doesn't have it as... We don't have, like, a war council or anything. They do have council power. But it's not to vote on uh, on wars. It's just to vote on... Um, what is it? I forget. It's not nothing to do with wars. I know that. Uh, you served the uh, Lordship of Last Hearth from Lady Barbara of Last Hearth. Wow, so Lake took the Hearth's, Hearth's title, Umber. Alright, um, he took High Lordship. Uh, accept your grace invitation, okay. I saw my mortal enemy, see? That's why. Lord of Hearth... Oh no, it's this guy. I think. Why is he my mortal enemy? When I stepped into Lord Paramount Edmund's castle... Um, who am I challenging? Lord Edmund is challenging... It is him, see? That's why I didn't go to that goddamn... Th well, I went to the tourney, but I didn't uh, try to be part of it. Because I think there's a thing where you can um, pay somebody to try to kill him. President Image more than I could bear. I longed to pick up my sword and impale him with it. <laughs> um, I don't want to spoil the feast. Hold on a second. It's not his feast. See, that's what I'm talking about. This is weird. Hosting an epic tournament. Hmm. Let's see if he'll do it. He's, he's wounded. Alright, he will do it. Hold on, what? I'm fighting a maester? Are you serious? Maester Martin dies. Uh, this guy must be kin with him. Why doesn't it show that it... Let me see what does it say. It usually says their old name. That's weird. Oh, uh, yeah. Back on your feet. <laughs> that was weird. I thought I was going to be doing it with him. Yeah, he doesn't like me either. Uh, strict exercise regimen you committed to after your decision to become a legendary warrior has made you one of the toughest persons around. I feel like I can lift a small house. So we get plus two health, which is great, for five years. And plus ten personal combat. That'll really help. He wants me to be commander. No, I'm not being commander. You won't press my goddamn claim. 
All right, uh, you accept. The first days of the jousting in Lord Edmund's turn is complete. Many lesser riders having already been eliminated from the competition. Now, over the coming days, the remaining men shall compete in the final list, tilting until only one champion remains. Um, yeah, whatever. Come on, man. Like, I hope this doesn't turn out to be a waste of time. What do you mean to have a claim that he can press? I do have a claim. I right, see this shit's getting crazy. The war must be valid. How is it not valid? I'm completely confused now, like what's going on. This shit don't make no sense. Oh He he just imprisoned him. What a dick. See, he likes us for the most part. We do need to get, uh, give him some money. I don't care. It's a lot of money, but it'll be worth it. Um, so yeah, he arrested him for some reason. In the dungeon. <laughs> it was him. He's holding a feast and got freaking arrested. You notice Lucan is acting very selfish by playing with other children. Who cares? I have better things to do. <laughs> uh, selfish will give him plus one stewardship. Dynasty opinion now goes down and spousal. Um, I don't see a big deal with lightning be. Yeah, be selfish, kid. All right. Um, your acquaintance, Master Corwin of Mormead, has died under suspicious circumstances. Yeah, he's probably that damn attorney. My courtier, Damon, was paired with Damon Sarsfield. Damon Sarsfield next for the next joust. The many tilts and broken lances, Damon is eventually unhorsed. Leaving regular Damien the winner. <laughs> uh, that's so weird. Sometimes they, they do these like uh, mess up sort of be too, the one guy is facing himself. Uh, so these guys are fighting. Damn, that dude's good. Jonifer Strong. He'll probably win. I think he did win. Third place. I don't know if that's this one. He won a regional tourney too. Uh, Sir Willem Derry and Damien Sarsfield are next to Joust. He is a uh, spy master to try to. I think we. No. That's the one guy that won a little bit ago. He's pretty good too. Looks like he won. Did he get. Small tourney wins three. <clears throat> My lord, since I arrived at Blackwood Vale, there has never been a shortage of soldiers reinforcing the troops stationed there. Under my guidance, they believe fame and fortune awaits them. Good job, brother. He's been a really good uh, master of arms. I think he's stressed, though. Hey, this is pissing me off. How do I not have a claim to press? Like, talking shit's ridiculous, man. I did it before, and it had no problem with it. So, but now, all of a sudden, it's saying I can't. <sighs> he's still... These, the... Aaron's keep trying to take runestone every person he ends up trying to take it and then he kills them and then they end up freaking the next person he tries to take it from and they revolt and then he kills them he's literally and they got two people left this guy and I guess another family member this Royce is the only one left so Royce is like they might die out here uh so we're on Darius or Ebrus Wayne now tilting. I would see Ebers. Uh, neither one of them are really good. Maybe after this feast it'll come back. Um, Willem Derry. Oh, that's the same one. Willem was the winner. It should be over now. Maybe this is the, t the title. Yeah, he just got third place, I think. Or no, it wasn't him. But yeah, he was winner of the tourney. That was a regional one. I should have did that one. Because a lot of times these things are setups to kill you. And a lot of people in the realm don't like me. Especially in the Riverlands. Increased council power. Oh! Hold on. Who is the other guy? I didn't think these people could join. Um. Yeah, I didn't think they could join. The, what you call it? How is this guy faith at a seven? He's my... He's my friggin' um He's under my lordship. It should be a uh should be an old god person. 
Can I revoke it? All right, opinion of you by minus six. Your other vows was by minus fifteen. Um, let me see. Is it worth it? This guy don't like me anyways. That one's gonna go negative. Uh, they'll be fine. All those guys will be fine. I really want to revoke it. Does it go to uh? See now it's saying it's a godswood or something. Let me see. Line of secession investor. So it's gonna end up going to. No, it shouldn't go to him. I don't. I'm confused how the hell that works. I think I have a uh, free whatever it's called, or they have it in the room, free investiture or something, where the uh, faith can give the title, appoint his own septons, lacking authority. Uh, appoint septons can withhold blessings. I don't know. Maybe if this guy dies and. If he doesn't, if he dies and it goes to a whole other person, then I don't know why it would go to him of all people. That's what I'm kind of wondering here. Can I do a claim to take this? I mean, a uh, plot instead of just outright taking it. Could kidnap him. Um, yeah, I think we're just gonna take it from him eventually. I really don't want to get the minus 15, even though he would give it up. Just to give it, let's just do that for now. Alright. Hopefully, is that turn he said it was over yet? I don't think it did. You served the Rose Road from Sir Darian Barner? Alright. What the hell? Alright, now it's over, I guess. Alright, it's back up there. But it still won't do it. Oh my god, this is pissing me off. Fuck, man. If I can't get him to press his claim before he dies, this is going to really suck. Alright, well, let me make sure I ain't paying for education before I do that. No! Oh, no. How are you injured? Uh, he, I think he played, he went to the fucking tourney, probably. He's injured and he, got, he has the flu. Come on, man. I can't have you dying. I mean, your brother's good, but you're just a tad bit better. Alright. After being skillfully treated by court physician John, my son Brendan's feeling much better. Perhaps he's deserving of some praise. Yeah, definitely. You need to keep him healthy. Alright. You got minus two, and then you got two health on top, so it kind of cancels itself out. Uh, Sir Walter Page has been a Leon Able servant. He sure has. He's gotten us a lot of claims, so I have no problem rewarding him. Alright. Let's give her. A focus. Ooh, her diplomacy is terrible. Um, I guess we'll do stewardship since she has a double positive here. All right, we need to find somebody decent stewardship. Mm, I got this guy. He's old gods. He's actually got decent learning too. He's probably gonna die before, but this guy's pretty good too. But he's also old as dirt. Um. He's a brilliant steward, and he's decent. Yeah, we'll put him. There we go. I also, uh, I betrothed my son's heir, who was going to be after him, and uh, with the a Dustin girl that was a genius. So I was going to do it with the one Targaryen girl we have in court, but Dragon Bagels burnt, built a lair in Blackwood Vale after escaping from Alice Lannister. What? What, she tried to ride him? I think she might have tried to ride his ass. Who's this? Ah, that's my nephew. A quick nephew. Sucks. Um, he's eight. <laughs> I forget who Vagel's rider was. I think it might have been Viserion. Or Viserys. Man, this is really ticking me off at this whole press of claim bullshit. My one son's trying to kill Magor. Why, I don't know. This is really bugging the fuck out of me. Like, why can't I press the claim? I have the claim. Like, before he did it. I don't know. If, I can't remember, though, if uh, this guy. I'm going to change him to some Jogos Nye guy just leading my mercenaries. 
Um, I don't really want to give it to any of my kids. I guess we can let this Tolly do it. Um, let's go like this. Who has the best other than the dragon? <laughs> um, this guy's old, but he's our commander. He's our treasure bodyguard. He's old as dirt. Um, he's old gods. I kind of want, I mean, new god. I kind of want a uh, person that's old gods doing it, but I can't really find any. This guy's our a bodyguard. Uh, this guy's old. And he's our priest. I don't know. I'll just leave it. Hell with it. I'm not going to put somebody that's like terrible in their marshal. Just because I don't want the Jogos Naga. guy. I mean, something really needs to happen here. Like, this shit's incredibly stupid. Uh, I don't know why they're telling me she died. Let's check out. Uh, we have a big realm right now. We still have almost a thousand more men we can have so we'll be over nine thousand men which is great we have probably 70 percent of or at least 50 probably of all the men that he monster from the realm oh it's not that much. we have nine percent uh turn current levy on the top lead is 10 i know that's that's for the hot uh, iron third i think um let's look so we got Total levy is nine. Hold on. Current levy is eight seven six seven. The most we have is nine seven four seven. Uh, we have over three thousand more men than he can have. So yeah, we're we're well out in the front. We also have two high lordships and three single lordships. Um, I'm thinking about uh, see if I get this, I'm able to press this high lordship into Bushwood. I need to give up one of these it's definitely going to be one of my sons but i'm thinking more of my youngest because my second oldest i don't know i might just give it to him they're both wounded he's done with the flu so that's good um she's yet to get pregnant which is kind of making it like worthless all right voting against the county you agree to do so i'm going to owe you a favor um he won't let us buy. This is one of the guys that wouldn't do it. So we're going to definitely accept this one. Um, I don't think there's actually any laws being voted for. I wish he could do that. It probably would make it easier to do. I don't know what it's talking about. The council must accept bullshit. It's really pissing me off. The council must agree. What fucking council? Your lord, your son Lucan is responding very well to my tuition. He has approved his skills and is advancing in knowledge every day. So Lucan's got two plus two learning, which is good. Um, four, oh, he become diligent. That's good. Hopefully, this brooding will turn to something else. Let's see, can we force train him? It looks okay. Let me see. Uh. This sucks, man. We can't go for any of these damn claims. It's really pissing me off, man. All right, this guy. Uh, Participate in turning a red fork. Mm, this is just a modern one. We're not doing it. Hopefully our sons aren't stupid and do it. They're already injured. Uh, well, 10. The hell is it? Let's see, is there anything intrigue wise? What's he want? Oh, come on. Who's this? Miguel Blackwood. Hmm. Propose that Sir Willem Derry. It's not bad. I mean, she's stewardship. It kind of sucks. I mean, I can always take it back. So we'll do it for now just to keep him happy. I think it'd go up, trusted, uh, whatever the hell it's called. We'll just change it. No, you're not going to be getting all my kids, dude. Like, come on. No way. No, I can't do it. I don't care how much. That'll go negative, though. That's bullshit. It should get entrusted with Guardian, and then, you know, but it takes away negative when you say no. 
I don't understand that. All right, we need a new priest. So this guy is the better of the two, I assume. Um, proselytize. He doesn't really have a good big percentage because his number here isn't that high. Hold on, I forgot which one it was now. I think it was gold broke. Is this guy's younger? All right, gold broke. It is. Let's see what the counselors are doing. This is really like bothering me because I'm trying to like figure in my head what it is that I can't why I can't do it. My son Brendan was paired with Brendan. See, this is what I'm talking about. Your son has been eliminated against Brendan, whoever that is. Look, my son Brendan and Brendan. Uh, I saw my mortal enemy as soon as I stepped into Lord Paramount Evans Castle. Presence it was almost more than I could bear. Uh, he's, he's the castellan of the Trident, but he's under him. How is that? Oh, the High Lordship of the Trident. Okay. Um, I'm not going to challenge him. I was at a tournament. At the, I was at the tournament, although I did not have an opportunity to distinguish myself in the melee. I was sitting around listening to two knights plot together to advantage themselves in the next bout. I listened carefully to their plan. And I instantly saw the flaws. So we got us an intrigue for that, which is nice. Um, is our son still wounded? Our other son's scarred now. He's got a little gash across the nose. Man, she does not want to become pregnant at all. Um, she's getting up there, too. Our acquaintance, Sir Aaron, is paired with Sir Aaron Shaw. Another one that's fighting himself. That's great. This game has so many stupid glitches. Sir Euphrates the Strong, or Euphrates Strong, and Simon Mandrake are next up. Uh, Euphrates declared the winner. Mandrake, that's a pretty cool little sigil there. I don't know what it is. It looks like some kind of plant. Uh, that guy's pretty good. He's not a good commander, but all them strongs are usually like really good uh, marshal. Sir Bernard Page is our justice here's son. Uh, he's actually won third place before. And he's going against the Aaron Shaw guy. This guy's pretty good, though. Wow, Bernard did win, though. Many tilts, two knights remain undefeated. You're pretty strong, Bernard. Right, let's go for our, our vassals, kid. Uh, Euphrates, ah, uh, Euphrates won. So he got second, or uh, third place? Second place. Now, I've worked in proving the domain of my liege, and I've recently been met with success in my efforts. He will surely be pleased. So he got extra five opinion for improving. Apparently we could use that fucking shit to get him to press this goddamn claim, man. This shit's unreal, man. I, don't, I have a favor. Like, how can I not use that favor? Like, it says it right on there. You can use favor to press claim, but for some reason I can't press the goddamn claim. I can't use him either. God damn it. I'm confused, man. All right, we're gonna go ahead and here. I don't think I'm, I don't care what happens next. If, uh, if until something pops off and we're able to do this, I'm probably just gonna go ahead in time unless something really big happens that you know kind of deters our whole thing. Um, I forgot we are educating Aenys Targaryen, who has a martial focus. Hopefully, we could turn him out to be brilliant. Um, he has a, uh, a pretty new dragon, Trogdax, I guess is how you say it. Um, he is actually betrothed to our daughter matrilineally, our granddaughter, I meant, because he's our courtier, he's going to do it. Um, after much food, brown ale, jousting, combat, Lord Jonifer Strong's tourney has finally ended. What a fine spectacle. I might make him, actually, the mercenary captain when he becomes 16. So, but until then, you please hit that thumbs up button and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Later.